All right, well, so it's been a while since I posted anything to YouTube and I thought, well, maybe I should try to start showing you a little bit about what my life is here in Amsterdam. And um, yeah, so I thought I might start doing some of these little video blogs and stuff like that. Uh, right now, you're gonna see what happens when I'm not studying. See, here's uh, here's my study notes, which I'm usually working on some things. Oh, yeah, sorry, don't mind the Brady Bunch thing there, no. I, I don't ever watch stuff while I'm working on papers or anything. Hey, um, so today I was biking home and totally my, my tire just went BAM! Like while I'm biking. So today I get to go and fix that. Like replace everything, the whole nine yards. So I'm gonna grab my trash that's sitting down here, take it out, and uh, yeah, I'll show you what it's like to fix a bike tire. <laughs> Loads of fun, welcome to Amsterdam. All right, so here I am. I thought I could do this outside, but I can't. It's just way too windy, and so I had to come inside. A nice little bike shed sort of thing here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so here's my bike. And let's see if I can find, oh, yep, there it is. There's this nice bulge right there. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, I tell you what, it was fortunate that this dude came out of the store and he totally helped me out and it's because of his duct tape that I was able to make it at least to the store and get a new bike tire. So, um, I've got all the essentials sitting over here for fixing a bike tire. So, I had to swipe my roommate's um, wrench because I don't have one of those. I got everything else, but I don't have a wrench, so that's something I need to go buy. Anyways, we'll see how this goes. All right, this has become way more serious than I thought it would be. I thought I could just release this one and move it and slide it in and out, but it's one of these internal shifter things, and I can't get it loose, so... I'm gonna have to go watch a video on how to do this. All right, so I'm back in my room. Apparently it didn't work. So I'm gonna watch a quick little video on how to change this tire and then we'll go back down and give it a try. So now that I've watched a couple of videos, I figured out how to actually do this thanks to the uh, wonderful people at, uh, what is this website? I don't know, maybe you're getting a glare off of that. Oh, I think it's like how to, yeah, wonder how to, um, it's got like cycling stuff and all that. And uh, these, these group, the beachbikes.com or something like that, they've got some great tutorial videos on there. So now that I've learned how to take the bike off, I mean the tire off, and adjust the wonderful little internal shifter, um, I'm going to have a go at it here and we'll give it a try. So I wish I could have gotten this on video because my neighbor actually just came down here and totally just manhandled my bike and it was awesome and now everything is in pieces-ish so we've got the old one and the new one so we'll see how this goes almost there well there she is all fixed so I'm super stoked it took way longer than I had planned oh and for my sister and brother-in-law guess what I found Good memories there. So let me show you the tire and what had happened to me. So here's the tire. Let's see if I can uh, find the hole. Yeah, here's the um, patch, which the hole pretty much covered the entire patch. I'm actually kind of shocked. It stayed pretty well. And then let me show you here. This, look at that. Both sides, dry rot. I love it. There's the duct tape. For those of you who don't believe that, I got by by duct tape in a patch. Nine kilometers. Yup. So, there we go. I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna get me something to eat because I'm hungry and it's late. Mm -hmm. 